hey you guys and welcome back to my channel hope you guys are having a great day today was quite an eventful day i had packages i had things getting free and everything like that so i'm really really excited to start sharing like some things with you guys today was actually a really 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 good day um i had stuff being moved in finally cleaned out my storage i'll put a clip right here <laughs> Oh my gosh, everything is cleaned out. The only thing that's left is the mirror, which they're going to grab right now. But you guys, this is it. Oh. And on top of all of that, today's video is in partnership with Container Store. So I am getting my house fully organized and I am really, really excited. So I'm going to go ahead and jump in into all the contents that I have. It's a lot of stuff, you guys. It's just grab you something to drink, pull your blanket, maybe it's bedtime, I don't know. And you can just wash this while you're kind of calming down the rest of the day. But I have the drawer liners. You guys were kind of like, why are you lying your drawers? I'm like, it's gonna come. I know it's gonna come because I had already spoken with Container Store like before I closed on the house. So I knew that I was gonna be figuring something out. I just didn't wanna think about it at that moment. But I went on ahead and I went on the website and this one here is the unscented blue marble. And then this one here is the scented fresh linen. This one's going in my closet and in the bathroom. So I'm really, really excited. I have a total of four rolls of this one here. And then this one here, I believe I have four or six. Yeah, I have six rolls of these. So this one here is the blue marble and it's so freaking pretty, you guys. I thought it would look really, really good in the kitchen. And then this one here is the scented. It almost gives off um, something a bit chinoiserie. I've never gotten the scented ones before, so I wanna... Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh, first of all, I'm not gonna like spray it on my body but to have this in the bathroom and in my closet oh this is gonna be amazing and you know what else i found like how do you order it i'm probably gonna go online and just order it myself they had these um what's it these like fragrance bags that you can put inside of your drawers and stuff like that like i like that i might take those baggies on i was thinking about putting them inside like my boots and stuff like that or my booties but these liners smell delish all right, so the next thing that I ended up picking up is a slew, and I mean a slew of the iDesign containers. This one here, if I'm not mistaken, is for the bathroom. I did measure, which you guys saw, the height, the width, and also how deep the drawers are. That way, every single container that I purchased made sense. You feel me? But then I also purchased iDesign for the fridge. So this one here is the wine holder just in case you've never seen the wine holder this is what it looks like and pretty much the bottle just kind of sits in here you guys know i don't drink so water will be going in here i actually selected the i design like fridge kit i think it was about like 200 dollars on sale and i believe it comes with either two or four of those and then this one here is the fridge and freezer bin i will say with the i design the stickers come off fairly easy you don't have to struggle through with it and so this one here, I can't wait to put in the fruits and the veggies in here. Oh my gosh. Something else that I got while I'm going that way, because that's the last box on this side. You know, I want it to be a little fancy. So I selected acrylic hangers. They're so cute, so extra. <laughs> I thought these were so freaking cute. I love them. I thought they were nice. They are called blouse hangers. Everything that I'm sharing with you guys, I'm going to be leaving it in the description box. If you're interested, you can check it out. Oh, you guys, my little pet bin. Oh, these are so cute. I am really, really excited because my fridge is going to be super healthy. Organized. I already told you guys. I don't know if I told you guys, but I know I was live and I was like, Oh my gosh, I'm gonna be as extra as I want to be because I always wanted to like buy like the small mini apple juices, small mini orange juices, just so the fridge can be like really nice and pretty and cute and stuff. And now it's gonna be like that. So I'm really excited. 
The next thing that I ordered, which I already opened it, you know, but it's from the company called Umbra, I believe is the name, and it is called the Flip Five Hook, all right? Now these can go anywhere. It can go in your closet, it can go behind your bathroom door, you can have it in your front entryway, especially if you have a small space and you're trying to find ways to kind of maximize that space. They can just open this and hang their things up. And if you were concerned about anybody poking their eyes out, which it should be higher than eye level, but okay. <laughs> you just wanna close it once they're done. And it ends up being like a really nice little detail on your wall. I picked up a total of three because I want these to go on the bathroom door. So when we're done taking a shower, you can hang your robe up, you can hang your towel up, whatever it may be, and you just know that it's situated. I love the fact that it's just like super sleek. The next thing that I got are these acrylic shelves. Now these are gonna go in the cabinet above the fridge because I wanna stack my plates and stuff in here and they're so pretty. I love them a whole lot. I feel like you can use the shelves this way if you wanted to or you can use them this way. This is something that I feel like it could be implemented in your office. It could be implemented in the bathroom. You could put it in your kitchen. I just think it's really nice. For this though, I am gonna be using it to stack the plates on top. That way I can have a little bit more uh, storage on how these things are going to be housed. Like I said, I did grab two. That way I can stack them in store, okay? All right, the next item is for the kitchen, which I'm so excited for this because I love, <laughs> love love my trivet which is pretty much that piece that you guys see that goes on top of my sink i told you guys right before i was gonna close i was like you guys i i've always had one i just never rolled it over the sink and one day i don't know what i was doing and i came across this thing and i'm like oh my gosh all this time i thought it was just you know for hot plates so i would take things out of the oven and put it on top of it wouldn't think nothing of it when in actuality, it was set up to go over the dock on sink. With that being said, I do have a single sink. I hope this fits. We're about to find out in 2.2 seconds. Oh my gosh, it fits. It looks absolutely perfect. So basically when I get done doing the dishes, I would do like this and I would take my towel and I would put it here like so. So basically this is what it would look like. Like I would let my towel stay here to dry and then put my thing here and then when it dries, I would like put it into there. You guys, it looks so good. 150,000%, that was a great buy. If you guys are interested, it is from the company called Collier. I actually went online and I found all these things previous <laughs> to this order. The thing is, I never measured, so when Container Store was like, hey, you know, we want to collab, I was like, okay, I'm going to go ahead and measure every single space that needs organizing. That way, I know everything fits, so make sure when you're ordering these things not to get too excited to measure your space before you measure any of these things, like I said, to make sure things are going to fit. The next one is the Container Store Expandable Bamboo Utensil Organizer. I love this. Even though it's a utensil organizer, I have a total of three. I'm gonna use this for my K-Cups. So basically, it, it, oh. <laughs> man, disrespectful, jeez. Man, they might just try to take out my tatas. Um, it expands out. So it goes from two to four. I'm gonna go ahead and put it in the drawer that way you guys can see that. OMG, it fits perfectly. So let me just show you really quickly because the reason why I did the bamboo is because the original finish on here has like that bamboo-ish feel. So I was like, you know what? I wanna kind of stick with that. So this is the really gorgeous thing about this. You can, I mean, it's not gonna leave too much on this side. But see, you can kind of play around with the spacing. Clearly, like I said, this side is pretty small. Can't really do anything with it. But you have a little bit more flexibility on how wide you want it. So basically, 
you know, I can put that. But I'm going to move these once um, my pantry kind of gets done. Because these big guys don't go in here. But these, oh my gosh, you guys. Like I said, I have a total of three. Okay, the collier was a good buy. But the organizer, like that was really good too. You guys, you know that I don't have any like window treatments and stuff. So the sun is just like right now, like right here. You see, it's like right here at this window. I do apologize about that. Um, maybe I'll move. Hold on a second. Let me see. Okay, that is much better, but I feel like it's gonna be moving this way, so I'll probably move this way so that way the sun isn't too bad. But anyway, you guys, if you don't know, I have Simply Human Trash and Recycling, the combo. What I did do is with this collaboration, I got my Simply Human bags. If you've never tried the Simply Human bags, you have to try them. Just because you don't have a Simply Human, you can still get the trash bags because they have um whatever gallon trash you have they have the bags for this one here on the box it actually says d and g that way you kind of know like which bags you need i just went on ahead and i did g because when the boys are done with like the only thing that i really buy a lot of like bottles of is water so i always rinse them clean them out and stuff and then i'm pretty much responsible for like the recycling stuff so i have a little bit more control so because i had them everywhere I went on and grabbed two, four, six, eight. <laughs> okay, Nadia. <laughs> I picked up 12 bags because I want to keep two sets upstairs in my bedroom, two in the boys' bathroom, and then um, the rest can stay in the pantry or even the laundry room. So, whenever we need trash bags, but. I try to take the trash out maybe twice a day. So that's what I did. And then for the boys' bathroom, I'm so excited. I'm gonna organize everything. Um, I have the eye design, which are these little small units here. Um, I don't know what's gonna go on these small units, maybe like the floss or something like that. But I'm gonna fully organize the entire bathroom. The next thing, which I think I'm gonna, I think I ordered three of these. So I'm gonna put one in my bathroom. Pretty much, um, you can use it like a garment hook or whatever. But I thought this was really good to put near my shower so that way I could hook whatever next to it. But basically, you would screw the back and hook that on there and you can use this. But if you had hangers for the work the next day, this is what I said, I'm gonna put it in my closet. It's like super cute because you can just put your hangers and get everything together. I was thinking about changing the finish of my bathroom from that shiny silver which is like that chrome but then there were just so many components to trying to change it i was like y'all won <laughs> y'all won we're gonna stay with this chrome if that wasn't enough the collier i also have me i also picked up this little drinker and it goes over the sink <laughs> So basically, if you're making vegetables, you would do the same thing. You would take this and put it over the sink. So of course, I'm gonna go ahead and put this over the sink. Before I got into my house, I was going insane. I was like, I have me a big old sink. I want me all the contraptions. I want all the fixings. And I did call about the, the um, grid to go at the bottom. So she's gonna look for that for me and reach back out to me because they are considered like an essential store. So I was like, I need everything, whatever they got to offer. So when I saw this, you guys know, like I love to cook, but I'm like, I could cut up my strawberries. I can cut up, you know, like some, I don't know, whatever I can cut up. I can cut up, put it in here, give it a quick little rinse, a little shake and shake, a little shake, shake, shake. And oh my gosh, you guys, it's so amazing. Let me put it in the sink real quick. I absolutely love it. I know you guys are gonna be interested in these. I know, I know you're gonna be interested in this, so I will be leaving it in the description box down below that way you guys can go ahead and grab them before they are sold out. I love it, I love it so much. You know, like, um, I don't know, I wouldn't consider myself to be like a gadget person, but I do love little things that just like, are really unnecessary but so necessary <laughs> like that is amazing i love it it's just perfect but um you guys know that i'm working um in the laundry room and i don't know if i'm gonna keep this because i'm, I'm gonna i haven't tried it yet or whatever but i saw this and i was like oh my gosh 
So basically they're cast iron wall mount. They're super heavy. They come with the two screws to go into that. I'm not worried too much about the anchor because it is gonna be going into um, a wood wall. So I'm not really worried about it. What I did love about it is it had a little insert and I do have cardstock paper and you can actually put names on here. So I thought it'd be really cute to put this in the laundry room. It looks almost like a uh, mail, you know, but I love it, you know, cause I was like, okay, I could put Tristan's name. I could put Aiden's name on it and they can have um, their own little name on the hook. I really needed to do four hooks, but I don't know why I just ordered three. I'm gonna go ahead and go online and order a fourth one. This one here is for flatware and that one is for utensils. I ordered two utensils and two flatware because I wanted one to have my stainless steel and then the other one to have like the one for nonstick. I don't know why I did that because my nonstick, I can use stainless steel on it. I don't have to um, just use the nonstick. So this is 13 by 18. And I believe the drawer is 19 inch deep, right? Oh my gosh, you guys, it's so pretty. And let me tell you, I was so attracted by this picture. Look at the black flatware with this bamboo in the drawer. I was like, this is everything. And even the drawer looks a little charcoal black or something like that. But I was like, this is amazing. So I believe the extension is 24. I believe this drawer over here is 36 or something. But I was like, okay, well, I can probably add this to it. That way I can fit in there, but it would probably go off to the side or something. And I can do like my flatware. So I am going to be on the hunt for some black just because I was inspired by that picture. I was like, oh, that's everything. So this one here is another I design fridge storage. So this one's probably gonna have like the apple juice, orange juice in here because there's two different compartments. I know I'm not gonna do the vegetables in there because I like the vegetable to go into the drawers down there. So that's that. This is the other one to the wine that I told you guys about. And pretty much these stack on top of each other like so. That way you can put it in the fridge. So when you're ready to get something, just grab it and you're good to go. Like I said, I didn't, I did not sit there going through the wine. Oh, sorry. Instead of me trying to figure out what I need it for the refrigerator or not, I was like, I can always just fix the fridge. Whatever I don't use, I'll just, you know, you know, you know, you know. But these are another iDesign drawer organizer. These are for the boys. So these two sets are going to be for them. And then I also grabbed this one. So basically, I'm going to take these upstairs. This one here is the four. They have can of tomato if you like organizing your pantry, but when I put this in my drawer in my bathroom, you're going to see how this looks so amazing. This is not the whole entire order. I ordered some more like pullouts and things like that to go inside of the uh, drawer. Um, this one here is 9 by 19, which I believe which is the same size. I'll know once I go upstairs. But then I also have these guys here to go in my bathroom. I'm gonna I'm gonna organize something today. You guys will get to see it tomorrow. And then I love this, you guys. This one's here is another fridge bin. This one here is another bin for the fridge. I'm probably gonna put like the bigger thing, like the milk and things like that, that have a tendency to kind of leave the fridge a little wet. A lot of you guys from my laundry room video, you guys were like, you should do a hamper, you should do this. One of the really great benefits of having the laundry room upstairs is I choose what day I wanna do the kids laundry. So I don't do all the laundry in one day. So I might do, you know, my youngest one Monday and then I'll do my oldest on a Wednesday and then I'll do mine on the weekend. So we all have our own hamper. There's no reason for me to like put another hamper in the laundry room. When the laundry was downstairs, yes, I used to be like, take this stuff downstairs and we wash everybody's stuff at once and then we just take it up one time, which was a lot of work. But doing the laundry, like breaking it up between days of the week, who I'm gonna do what day is much better. But what I did decide to do with that space in the middle is not put another unit because I already have that um, mudroom situation on the wall. The inside of the cabinetry, well, the inside of the closet is fully done. And then I have the cabinet above head. I think something else in the middle would just be entirely too much. So I saw this online. I was like, this is amazing. 
amazing. So this right here is called a laundry valet. And what it does is it screws on the bottom of your laundry and then it has a magnetic little pincher on the side to hold this. So what I thought is, it's basically a standing clothing rack or whatever the case may be. And it has one, it has five little balls at the very top of it. And like I said, it latches on to the side of your washer or dryer. And I really liked it because I was like, I, the way they, oh, oh, sorry. Okay, the way they have it on this picture is that it's facing this way. So what I'm gonna do is have it facing the middle. So if I hang up my dresses and I hang up things, it's gonna be hanging up right there, which I think I was live and I was like, man, I had washed that blue and white dress. I didn't have anywhere to put it. So what I did is I took the cabinet doors, I folded them close together and I hooked the straps of the dress and then it basically dried the next I got it. But this is gonna be so, so much better. So if you have a laundry room and you have a small confined space and you're trying to figure out what to do with it, if you're not needing an actual hamper in that space, then I would highly, highly recommend this one here because the second I see it, I was like, that's what I need because I do have uh, maxi dresses, I do wear summer dresses, sun dresses, dresses in general, you know, and I don't really like to dry those things. If I could just like put on a hanger, my acrylic hanger and hanging up, oh my gosh, that'll just be so amazing. <laughs> oh, so extra, I love it. Okay, you guys, oh, give me the trash bin, Tris. I need that. Oh, you like to wear it in your room. Yeah. Thank you. Oh my goodness. Okay, you guys. <gasps> I'm only human. This is my Simply Human recycling okay. bin. Uh huh, you're welcome. This is my Simply Human recycling. Again, you have the D&D &D trash. I'm guessing the G is for like the regular schmuggler. I don't know. I just got the same size for both, which is why I got so many bags. Um, I love this. It's in the kitchen right now under the sink. I haven't used it yet, but I know when I do, I'm gonna love it. Okay, but for right now, I really, really love it. I just wanna thank Container Store so, so very much for helping me organize my life, organize my house, just like organize in general. And it's so funny because I feel like when your house is in order and things are together, and I've always said this, like I can go outside and look crazy, but I know I got my stuff together. You know, how other people feel is that's their business, but you know, knowing that everything is in its place, like that just makes me feel so good. Like the laundry room being organized is just like amazing. My closet is about to be organized, which is amazing. The kids are, oh, namaste. I know some of you guys have been asking about the uh, green cabinet. It's currently in the garage. I am gonna have Noah somehow, some way, build me another system on the side, and I'm gonna go see, and I'm gonna see if I can get that unit. Possibly, um, Sharon Williams to do a color match. That way, the wall unit would match the color of the vanity. That way, I can take the the unit, the wall unit that Noah builds and take that piece and flush it against it because the side isn't finished. It was for someone's bathroom. Tony built it for someone's bathroom and it ended up being the wrong color and they were gonna trash it. You guys remember. So I would take that unfinished piece and put it right against that one, let the guys drill it. That way, almost like a shoe rack, but I'd be able to put all of like my fabrics, the tile, all of that, it would be storage in the garage. It's not really dusty in there. It's not really like whatever. As long as I leave the garage door like down, um, even in the last house, it stayed pretty clean. I may have to go out there once a month and do like a quick wipe down, but the more sensitive materials, I would have them inside of the actual cabinet. It's pretty big and I know that I can house quite a bit of things in it. But um, I'm excited. It's not gonna happen tomorrow, so don't don't start asking me, can we see the garage, Nadia, because it ain't done. It ain't gonna be done. I told you guys, I'm on a hiatus of spending money, okay? We're on a hiatus. You know, I'm not gonna come on here and just pretend that I just got <laughs> a rich uncle somewhere, because I don't. <laughs>
or my daddy rich because I he ain't <laughs> okay so what I am gonna do though is put these things in before it gets a little too dark that way you guys can see it and then I'll see you guys on the next one have an absolutely amazing organized day bye okay so this whole thing expands like this right but what I'm thinking is I'd rather do it like this and fit this here so I get more, right? And I want to do, and what I want to do is I want to do, so it'll be one, two, I think I can probably fit a third one in there, maybe not. You guys, oh, yes! Okay, act like y'all didn't see this for today, okay? Act like y'all didn't see this. So I can put the things over there and I can free up my cabinet and do my seasonings here. And then if I do another shelf, now when I'm cooking, I can just grab this out, season my stuff and put it back. I like this. Yeah, I like this. I'm excited. Okay. Okay, so I'm gonna have to get <gasps> the pink ones fit. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh my god. The things that makes me happy. All right. Basically, I think this is what I'm gonna end up doing. Do my seasoning here, spoons, forks. Cause I already have my knives, right? A couple little things right here. Okay, I'm done. Thank you.